I am here to show you my homemade saddles I make. Um, first off to start, if you have stirrups you made, which are, these aren't good, these are my first ones I've ever made, I haven't done anything with them yet. As you can see, they do turn out better when I actually try, but yeah. Um, first of all, get some tin foil, this shape. And if you have any leather material, use that. If not, then just use any material that you have. Um, and then cut around it with the leather, so it'll be that shape. Stick, double-sided sticky tape on one, or Dad just dropping something off. Not to do with me though. Um, I'm going to need a little bit of sellotape because any tin foil won't stay like that. A shape if I don't use it. Um, yeah. So, once you've done that, it'll be that right now cut out a saddle shape that shape or any saddle shape you really want that's going to be mine it's going to have like a sort of groovy wiggle lines in it and then cut out something that shaped like you might not be able to see it because it's like the same material but that bit there can you just see where the line starts and ends yeah we've just done that Double side those together, uh, and then you've got quite far. And then get your double sided tape again. I haven't measured which horse it's going on yet. I've not done the girth, I've not gone this one over here. Okay, well, it's about the same length. So get some of the sticky tape, but it's the same length as that. Yeah, stick that on the back. This other tape's just for support. Okay, right, so I'm not very good at this bit. Undo sticky tape, there's nothing on that. And it's on there. Get this into place, making sure that this bit here is right at the front not hanging over the edge and then do that so then that's all right but you probably can see the tin foil but that doesn't matter so it would look like that and then we would Measure it. it. Doesn't fit that one. Why is it this one don't go around yet? More like a racing saddle on that one. Bit better than that one. This one might do it. There we go. I'm going to place it on the back. Um, if you don't have any of this material from Paper Chase, ribbon, just use any other material that you have that would do the same sort of job. So now I'm trimming mine there. I don't know if it's the right size or not. If it's not, then I can use this for another one of my head collars. Um, I know the girth is a different colour but it doesn't really matter, just as long as it gets around the horse and the saddles are secure, it's fine. Obviously
see this is just sort of rough. I would usually take more time, but I don't really fancy doing a long video. My friend's going to be here soon. Who I do the videos with. Her name is Melanie. My channel is Ellis and Megan, but my friend Megan isn't coming over. I don't really see her that much. But yeah, so that girl probably around the right place, uh, maybe a bit far back, but it doesn't really matter too that much. So as long as you have a saddle and stuff, you'll be all right. Um, Yeah, Mel's going to be here, don't actually know when, I'm just trying to work it out now. In about an hour. So I have enough time for a couple more videos, if I can. Of course it's fell over. If you want to add a martingale, just add it on. This horse is really hard to make bridles for. So yeah, now all we have to do is get some material and droop it down like stirrups, which you can add underneath this if you really want, and just put your stirrups there and it's done. Okay, thanks for watching, you clicked on rude comments, please subscribe and rate and I'm not sure, I'll do a better job on the tack and stuff once I've got different colours much better I'm not sure if I'm selling it or not I can't really make up my mind I'm sort of letting you guys decide if it's good enough to sell and if it's not then I'll just keep it but if it is then I will sell it okay thanks and bye watch my other video and do remember I am on my dad's account putting new videos on because I can't log on to mine at the minute because it's already on his so yeah. Alright, thanks, bye.